Hi and welcome to Executive Impressions TV. I'm Kara, your host and your go-to expert for advice and tips about business etiquette, leadership skills and executive communication around the world. Today I want to talk to you about body language and specifically powerful, confident body language for businesswomen that won't detract from your feminine traits. Now, in the world of body language, we're often told that if you want to convey confidence and power, you need to take up more space. You need to use expansive, open body language movements to claim your place in this world. While this advice does work, and studies have proven that it works, from my experience working with businesswomen all around the world, I found that this advice also creates a lot of confusion and a little bit of resistance. For example, one client wrote to me and asked, as a woman, what are the best body language postures to use when you want to portray confidence and elegance without scaring others off? And another client wrote to me and asked, what are the best, how do you use open body language gestures when you're sitting down in a skirt? So today I want to talk to you about powerful yet elegant body language gestures that you can use when you're sitting down. And next week I'll publish part two of this video where I'll talk about powerful yet elegant body language gestures you can use when standing up. Let's say you're at a business meeting. Conveying power and elegance when you're sitting down can easily be achieved if you focus on these three things. In one of my online training programs, one of the things I often tell my clients is to use the armrests on their chair when they're sitting down. So when you're in a business meeting and you're sitting down, use the armrests on the chair, place your arms on the armrests, let your hands hangle, dangle over the edge, and lean back into the chair to show you're relaxed. By using the armrests of your chair, you're taking up more space, and this helps you to project more confidence and power. So the second thing you can do to convey power during a business meeting is to use the table in front of you. So place your elbows on the table, extend your forearms out in front of you, and spread your papers out a little to take up even more space. And the third body language weapon you can use is to make eye contact with each person at the table. So when it's your turn to speak, keep your head high, turn your head slowly from left to right, looking each person in the eye for a couple of seconds as you speak. When you make solid eye contact with others, it shows that you're comfortable with your opinions and you aren't afraid of anybody asking you any questions. I hope you found these body language tips insightful and useful. If you did, then I want to invite you to find out more about my online training programs where you can work with me one-on-one -on -one to learn more. So go to the URL on the screen below where you can learn more about power dressing, powerful body language and strategies for a powerful voice. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, then I encourage you to sign up to the Executive Impressions Weekly Newsletter. This, it's the place you want to be to learn the social skills to thrive in business and in life. I'll see you again next week for part two of this video. Thank you again for watching Executive Impressions TV.